I'm in Puerto del Sol in central Madrid where the Quince MM movement is now packing up uh, its uh, protest which has been holding since the middle of May. Uh, people have been camping out here in the square for the last month or so but today that's all coming to, a, to an end apart from a small band of, um, of uh, radicals who are going to stay on but the, most people involved in, in this protest are moving on today. Um, they're going to be taking their protest elsewhere out into neighbourhood assemblies uh, across the city and uh, they're going to be holding one-off protests um, in other places and public institutions and so on. Um, the big question now is what impact uh, has the Quince MM movement had on Spanish society? And in a way it's too hard to know um, at the moment. Maybe it's too early to, to know if it has had any impact. But I think we can say that people um, are talking about issues uh, that they were not talking about, uh, let's say, a couple of months ago even. A lot of people have become politicised um, purely because of this movement. It's got people talking about things such as labour reform or controls over banks or controls over politicians and corruption. Issues that people weren't necessarily so interested in just a couple of months back. Now, we don't know whether the Kinsema movement is actually going to be able to uh, change those issues, carry out reforms, implement reforms on those issues. But it has certainly got people talking about them.